So Nintendo launched two new systems in 2017, the Switch and the new 2DS XL, but one of these things is not like the other. Hell, actually these are two completely different systems, so we're gonna take a look what each of these has to offer. What is up my friends, it's Ray back here and welcome to the 10th, yes 10th episode of Ask Ray Anything, yay! Now this series is basically where you guys get to ask me anything, so if you guys have any topics that you want to see a video made of, make sure you leave it down in the comments box down below. So today by popular demand, we're going to be comparing two systems that Nintendo launched in 2017, the new 2DS XL and the Switch. So if you guys are any bit familiar with these two systems, or if you've seen my previous videos on these things, you know that even though the new 2DS XL launched a few months after the Switch, it is very much the older of the two considering it is technically just another variation of the 3DS. So here's a fun fact for you, the new 2DS XL has exactly the same specs as the new 3DS XL which launched over two years ago, which means that this can play the entire library of 3DS games including the new 3DS exclusives. Even though the new 2DS XL has the faster processor, amiibo support, extra shoulder buttons, and C-Stick, literally everything about this system is exactly the same as the original that launched in 2011, I mean it plays the same games and does exactly the same things. That's not a bad thing at all though, considering the massive library of games that the 3DS has, but as you know, compared to the Switch, the specs are still pretty underwhelming, especially when you compare it to the screen. I mean, the new 2DS XL still has a 240p screen on it compared to a 720p screen on the Switch. Don't get me wrong though, they're both pretty low res by today's standard in 2017, but that 720p screen on the Switch is just so razor sharp. Once you check it out, you'll never want to go back. Given that though, it's actually pretty surprising to find out that the battery life between the two is actually really pretty similar at four to six hours depending upon the game. I find that really interesting because this can play home console games in HD on the go and this cannot and you still got four to six hours of battery life which is pretty insane. That pretty much means that comparing technical specs between the two is kind of really not fair. Each and every single one of us knows that the Switch is loaded with incredible amounts of tech from the Joy-Cons to the console itself to the ability to play in handheld mode or on the big screen on the TV. But here's another fun fact for you. Even though the Switch is capable of some intense gameplay, it's the new 2DS XL that has the multimedia features such as YouTube, Netflix, and even just a simple web browser. Hell, even the $79 original 2DS has a web browser. Like, what? I know Nintendo announced these are coming, but I really do think that the Switch could only benefit from having at least just a web browser. So in short, to put this video into conclusion, if you want the latest and greatest games, obviously the Switch is definitely going to be the way to go. Even though it's double the price at $200, $99, you're going to be getting the better graphics, the more powerful hardware, and of course, Nintendo's latest and greatest games as they release. The 3DS as a whole, on the other hand, has been out for over six years, so it's pretty obvious that the new 2DS XL will stop getting new games way before the Switch. But in all honesty, it's not like you're ever going to be bored because the 3DS library of games is just loaded with some incredible and amazing 3DS and DS titles, backwards compatible titles, that you can play anytime, anywhere. In the end though, which one you want to pick up really depends on what you want to get out of the system most. Do you want the more powerful hardware or do you want to just have some casual games on the go? Whatever you want, you can find it on either one of these systems. Alrighty guys, that's about it for this video. If you liked it, you know the drill. Be sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, be sure to leave a comment down below letting me know which system you prefer. Do you prefer the Switch? Do you prefer the new 2DS XL or any one of the 3DS variations? I would love to know your thoughts down in the comments box down below. Alrighty guys, that's about it. Make sure you subscribe for new videos every Thursday, Sunday, sometimes more. You know it is going down over here on the channel. So until next time, I will catch you guys later. Peace.